this community has lost faith in your office because of partly because of your posture and partly because of the DOJ report. So I would encourage you to take time to review all those allegations and then and work with the AG's office. And with that opening statement, Van Valkenburg spent nearly an hour defending the county's position and specifically the claims of the DOJ letter. Commissioner Michelle Lanquist was especially concerned about another letter exchanged two years ago between the DOJ and then Attorney General Steve Bullock, indicating the feds would report any problems they found in their investigation. She said if she'd known about that, she wouldn't have voted to spend money on a lawsuit challenging DOJ's authority. The thing that's gotten lost in this is they're making sure that the um, responsible thing is getting done when it comes to representing victims and prosecuting the criminals. I don't think that I misled you or that I tried to mislead you. Van Valkenburg then went on to complain the DOJ hadn't given specific instances in its claims. It is amazing if they think that we are as bad as they claim we are, that they have no cases, they have no evidence over the course of over a year and a half to even give to the Attorney General. And Van Valkenburg was emphatic defending his staff. No one in our office treats victims inappropriately. We don't work that way. We do not treat people inappropriately. We don't treat these as low priority cases. We never will. I think we have a responsibility to take a principled stand you know, and you're doing the right thing. The DOJ has until early April to respond to the county's lawsuit. In Missoula, Dennis Bragg, MTN News.